Welcome to the interview. Uh, we've heard uh, briefly of the, what you're going through after the case was thrown out relating to the land, uh, Mr. H. Lema. Uh, but uh, could you narrate to us what has happened to you so far? We have been harassed for almost a, we have been harassed almost for a month now. We have been running away from the people who moved out here, you know. But uh, where, where, how exactly are you being arrested? What? How exactly are you being arrested? Almost a month. How? My wife was beaten okay. at night, two weeks ago. Okay. So, uh, where uh, are, are you in hiding or? Yeah, hiding. Okay, so uh, have you reported uh, the matter since the harassment began to the police? My wife went there to the police station. She reported the matter. Okay. We have also heard rumors that uh, you have been forced to appeal uh, the case which you lost in court. Uh, is that true? Yeah, it's true. Okay, Wh who is forcing you? There are some people who came to my wife at home. And when she refused to give them my number, she was beaten after two days. I just heard that she was beaten by unknown people. Okay. Did you receive any money before uh, the case uh, was taken to court? Written? No. No. Okay. Uh, uh, how about those that are forcing you to appeal? Did they offer you any money in return? Nothing. They were just giving us some transport money. Okay. And uh, by asking you to appeal, did they say that uh, they, they, if you don't appeal, something hap will happen to you? They didn't say anything. They didn't tell us. Even the judgment, they didn't tell us. After we lost the case, After we, we lost were not it. even told whether we lost it or not. We just heard in the media. After some time, we heard that we have appealed. Oh, we did appeal. Okay. So what's the way forward for you now? We just want a protection for you. We want to pro report to the police. But we are now tired of running away from our homes. Okay. Okay.